Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. It's Link's Little Triforce here with... Jack Felgar. And we're back with Dream Daddy. Dream Daddy. We're going to get some sleep. We met, uh... Met What's-His-Face. Always carry a pocket knife. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, we Well, we met Hugo, and we met... What, what Damien, was... Damien. What was Vampire Dad? I don't know. Vam- we met Vampire Dad. Jack... Oh, that's me. Yeah, you're sleeping. I'm Jack. What a sleepyhead! What? Oh, okay. Five more minutes. Never let me have five more minutes, so get up! See, that's what we get. Fine. I burped. Who's the child? I mean... Cereal for breakfast and spend the morning putting together furniture. Amanda is much better at interpreting the tiny manual. Ah. Uh, well, is, is there any words in the manual? Maybe they were... Maybe it's named something funny. Mm. You excited right, for the cookout? cookout? It's cookout today. day! Ooh. It's cookout day! Ooh, ooh. Uh, Beef up my grilling skills. Yeah. Learning opportunity. If I can snake some hot grill tips, I think we can consider it a success. Yes. I mean, sure. Might, why not? I'll probably end up standing uncomfortably in the corner with a plate of food and hope that no one talks to me. Aww. Uh, well, what was, uh, what, what's Aaron's name? Joseph. Oh, cr- Joseph Aaron? Yeah. Dad, your beautiful work in progress. We will get that butterfly to emerge from the cocoon. Aww. The social, social butterfly. butterfly. Got it. Well, I mean, you're, you're, you're more of a social butterfly than this we dad. I definitely don't want to be late. I mean, You're very if, I, if I was by myself... Yeah, I, I mean, yeah. I don't know. I don't but know. You, you've always got a knack for, like, meeting new people. Mm-hmm. Oh, we gotta go early. I mean, God, I hope... Yeah, that, Joseph. hope somebody wants to talk forever about, like... Like, shows that are, are cowboys in space. Because, like, that's, like, my favorite thing is cowboys in space. Yes. Veggie plate. Yes, we have a store-bought veggie plate. Um, oh no, there's uh, two other veggie plates. I mean, most people Crap. have a veggie plate. Hey, it is Joseph. Joseph. Jogs over, arms open wide. Hi, hug? Joseph Aaron. Any raw veggies? Come on, kids. Chris, my eldest. Oh, okay. he grumpy. Hi. Oh, and Christian and Christy, they're twins. Okay. Uh, oh, they've got like um scary um, dead eyed children. Um And there's Chris. 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 Oh, that poor kid. What a stupid name. Chris. Chris. Oh no, it's the woman from the oh, bar. Oh no. Oh, oh no. it's Mary. Oh, they're married. Oh, no. Mary's married. Oh no. Oh, Krish. Okay. Uh, God, I mean, we the didn't, poor kid. We did not stop her. No, we did not. Which is good because she scares me. But she, but she might know that we went home with Roberto. Hmm. Mary, this is our new neighbor, Jack and his daughter Amanda. Yeah, that's it. Ah, she's a lush yeah. everywhere. Yeah, she just drinks everywhere. Let's do a uh, meet you, Mary, for the first time. Oh. She doesn't remember. She doesn't she's, remember she's us. Really Good. Drunk. Good. <laughs> I wonder if Joseph knows that Mary knows that I know. I mean, I am too interested in this uh, circular Who reasoning. Who knows? Wonderful sense of humor, but please, you I mean, she's really the drinking. Barbecue. I mean, I don't know where the joke was. She was, she was like drinking. Ooh, who's Matt? Matt, who? Hey, Matt, come here and meet our new neighbors. This Ooh. is Jack and Amanda. Oh, Hi, Matt. He's like huh. super tatted. Hey, dude. Hey, dude. Hey, dude. I'm Matt. Nice to meet you too. 
Matt runs a coffee shop down the street. Oh, we would have met him earlier. Met him. Oh, man. I love carrot cake. Aw. Time to have sex with him, I suppose. <laughs> wow. Just for a <laughs> carrot cake? I mean, yeah. Would, Woo! Would Easy pleaser. Hey, man, you found out a guy who plays violin in an animated movie, and you were like, I will suck his dick. <laughs> uh, Whispers of the Heart, ladies and gentlemen. Whispers Go of the Heart. watch that movie. Yeah, I know. There's a, there's a violin player. That's me. Yeah, I'm the music guy. Hey, he plays music. Eddie's music? Well, I well, mean, we might have to go for Matt now. We'll have to share his peen. <laughs> I'm just the music guy. I always stoked to discuss music, uh, tunes, and stuff. And stuff. That's, That's so, so cool. cool. I, I love, love music. music. I was in a ska band. Y- you were? Hey. What kind of stuff do you listen to? Dad rock? Probably dad rock. Maybe, uh, uh, you know, with the guitars and the drums and the lyricism about growing older and seeing the world change before your eyes and you don't know how to deal with it. Aww. Buddy, I relate to that. Good. We didn't lose him. Cool. All right. So. Awkward. Right. Cool. cool. Well, uh, make the rounds. Feel free to stop by later. Is he as afraid of people as you are? Might, he might be. be. I'm gonna go try out the food. Deviled eggs. Oh, I like deviled eggs. With the paprika on it. The paprika. With the papa paprika. Come on, Dad. Who are you gonna party with if I go off to school? Uh, Robert. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't know. He might just be a one nighter. Oh, he might be. But he was. Talk about the but weather. we had mutual sport love. Of opposite teams. Uh, but yeah, but like we respected each other. How could I possibly abandon my only child to a social function? That's bad, bad parenting. parenting. This plate of cookies is my new dad. Aww. Aww. Here goes nothing. Some familiar faces. Oh, who else is here? It's coffee guy. Or is he music guy? He's, he's both. He's, he's coffee both. music guy. That's Matt. Oh, dang. Robert's here. Ooh, Robert. Hey. Oh, uh, that's... Uh, Frisbee guy. Brian. 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 Brian Beardley. Brian. And vampire guy. And Hugo. Teacher. And Craig. And I'm Craig. Wow, everyone lives here. That can't, can't be, be right. right. I better investigate. Uh, um, who do we want to talk to? Uh... Matt, Hugo, and Craig. Okay. Craig looks on smiling politely. We should probably hang out with Craig. He's he's somebody. I mean, I we knew. know him. Yeah. Well, I don't think it's fair to try to compare two art movements like that. Jeez, and art only exists because they're a unique byproduct of the social and political climate of a time and place. And try to take something like, say, the Rococo period and compare it to the postmodernism in U.S. in America. You're completely disregarding the context in which this work of art is created. You seem to be busy in talking. Craig leans in. Dude, I have no idea what's happening. Uh... Let's talk to Craig. This is train going the other day. Great. Little River here is a great cheerleader. Aren't you, tiny bro? Oh. Ooh. Yay. I'm so proud of you. I'm sorry for pooping on you. <laughs> Go, River Baby. Mm-hmm. Bro. Bro. It's so worth it. And I'm also starting to throw it up on your dad. Oh, man. How you settling in? Uh. Almost done? Almost done. There's still a few odds and ends. Take care before I can really call myself settled. With figuratively speaking. Figuratively speaking. We did livable throughout the entirety of college. Well, yes, that's true. Yeah. My goal is for Amanda to live the sort of life that didn't involve eating spoonfuls of ranch dressing as a palate cleanser between different types of pizza. She still does, though. Mm. <laughs> I mean, we did a good job. Hey, she takes takes after Dad. Hey, look at the new neighborhood. Hey, hey what's up, Hugo? 
pretty nice. Everybody's been super friendly. Seems like your daughter is fitting in just fine. Uh -huh. Flower crowns. Aww. Oh, cool. It's a flower crown. I thought you'd look cute in it. Only one way to find out. Oh, but I don't see a flower crown up here. Where's my flower crown? I wish they had put it in there. Slightly less uncool than you were before you put it on. Hey, there it is. Oh, there's the flower crown. There we go. That's cute. Hello, daughter. Carmen's... Carmencita. 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 Dad, look, I'm making friends. Good. Yeah, actually, Amanda, you remember the cool barista from the coffee shop? And my old college friend. And, uh, your teacher? Whoa, hi, Mr. Vega. Didn't realize we were neighbors. Oh. Yup. You still gonna get me that overdue term paper? <laughs> Great seeing you. Okay, bye. Finger guns her way out of the conversation like a champ. You should do that paper, though. Yeah, you should You should do that paper, by the way. I'm very proud she learned the finger guns move from me. <laughs> Jeez. She's definitely a charmer, speaking of which. Where did my son go? Oh, he has got a son. Oh, huh? where is he? Ernest! Ernest Hemingway Vega. Oh, my God. Course. It's my cousin's naming... Mm -hmm. Literary children names. It's like Sawyer and and Atticus. Yeah. Lorelai. Oh my goodness. Ernest. Ernest. Stop mm -hmm. smoking, Ernest. It's bad for you. Uh oh. Kids, Kids right? right? Am I right? Oh man. Oh man. Why would he put it in his Ernest, butt? Ernest, you shit. Burned down half the yard? Wow. Oh no. Oh no. You lost half your yard? Oh, look at him. He's so. He's so smug. Is that Ziddy? Is he Ziddy? Yeah, I think Those so. Little zits. He kind of looks like an older, angstier uh, YB. Oh man. Actually, yeah. Hmm. From Coraline. Yeah. You should watch that movie too. We're making a lot of references this episode. <laughs> Ernest. Hello, Ernest. Just looks away, sulking. His hands shoved deep into his pockets. Deep. Deeper. So far that he's touching his own hands because it's one giant tube. It's a pocket. Hey. Nice to meet you, Ernest. What, what grade, grade are you in? in? Doesn't mm -hmm. matter. I mean, sort of. Ernest. Okay, okay, I'm in eighth grade. God, are you happy now? Sure, you're just dying to know. I could, I could uh, really care less. Yeah, but good, yeah for good for you, you little shit. You grew older and stuff. Can I go now? I'm tired of talking to old dudes who blame my generation for the failing economy. You're in eighth grade. We're not blaming you yet. Uh, wow. Eventually. Ernest! Oh well, yeah, because I'm totally embarrassing you. I mean, you are. I mean, you're kind of a shit. Well, that was certainly something. He seems nice. You're lying. Yes, oh. I am. So sorry, he's really having a rough time. You gotta be the authoritarian dad. He really resents oh. me for it. Oh well, I mean, you gotta keep him in line. Are any of us cool dads? Is it even possible to be a cool dad? What? I'm cool as a cucumber. I'm such a I wanted liar. her to be like, I'm cool as fuck. See, right there, you can't say that. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for calling me out, Matt. My kids think I'm cool. But for how, how long, Craig? Craig? How long? Do you get to be the cool dads? I, I, don't, I don't know. We've become the machine we once raged against and accept our fate to unironically wear socks with sandals. I still don't wear socks with sandals. No, you don't. You I was, are adamant against I'm that. I'm adamant because it's terrible. Oh, she's 18. Oh, okay. She still thinks I'm cool. Amanda, I'm cool, cool right? right? 
Oh. No, stop it. Stop it. I see your point. Oh. Yep, good yep, dad over cool dad. Yep, that'd be a good dad. dad. Good dad over cool dad. It's very true. I mean, look at me in earnest. I mean, your kids kind of suck here. Tell his parents to make sure our t- kids are. He okay. might. He might come out of it though. He could. Hopefully, hopefully he'll come out of it. On the Eighth end. grade is like right in the middle of the poopiness. It's, yeah, that's not a good time. Hearing these guys talk makes me think of my relationship with Amanda. We get along so well, but there might be a time when it won't be like this. Is college when it happens? No, you actually sort of already passed it, but don't. Oh, well, all right. Go meet some They the want to get rid of us. Uh, um, how about Joseph and Damien? Yeah, because we didn't get to see too much Damien. I saw Joseph chatting with the guy from Dead Gotham Beyond by the grill. What are you talking about? I walk over to them. He probably wants his shit rear. So I'm curious, can you walk me through why you had your house painted black? Uh, because... Where do I even start? The house stays warmer in the winter, provides an artistic contrast to the rest of the neighborhood, and it kind of Oh, you have crimson. crimson. You are literally a vampire. Are you a vampire? He's a vampire. He's a vampire. Interesting choice. Oh, I have a bright blue house in my neighborhood that's like absolutely disgusting oh uh, it's it's like grover from sesame Street yeah it's blue. grover blue it's pretty it's bad not not pretty. to be one of those catty dads but like that house is gross yeah it's like bizarre <laughs> color but whatever jack i was just having a conversation with damien here about his aesthetic design decisions yay he gives me a warm, warm but, but critical, critical eye, eye. How do you do? I don't believe I've had the pleasure. I watched you. Uh, uh I saw you over at Hoto. I mean, Dead Gotham Beyond. Oh, uh, I apologize for my behavior around that day. You see, I take goth lifestyle very seriously, and to be caught in a ruse by such corporation as Dead Gotham Beyond was profoundly frustrating indeed. Oh man! I hopefully, hopefully, I hope you know that while my anger may, may have, have been justified, justified, it was in no such way for a gentleman to act. Oh, goodness. Uh, it's okay, it's, man. Yeah, it's, it's cool. Okay. Do tell me about yourself. Are you new to the area? Uh, sort of. Moved across town. Yeah. Hmm. Very good taste in her part. Does she partake in the goth lifestyle? Uh... Huh. Hey, Amanda, would you consider yourself goth? We hipster with some norm norm core leanings. God, we are so lame. What? I bet somebody else would understand this completely. I don't. Man, we are like uncool dad status. What know. is twee hipster and norm I core leaning? I mean, I think this is. Bats are cool though. Yeah. Nice. Okay, I get that one. <laughs> ah, pity. Are you enjoying the party so far? Oh, definitely. Thanks so much for putting this on. It's nice to be in a cul-de-sac where everyone is so friendly and welcoming. Oh, we might have to. We might have to end this one. I like Lost Boys a lot. Really good movie. Does that count as goth? It might be. That would, my dear. I don't believe we've had the pleasure of meeting Damien Blood March at your service. Goodness gracious! All right, we're we're gonna end that. He had to have changed his last name. There is no way he was born with that. Blood March. Blood March. All right, guys. Well, on that note, we're gonna save here, and we'll uh, we'll. Talk to Mr. Blood March a little bit more next time. Yeah, and Joseph, what a what a mix. Bye. <laughs>